So Miss Azalea Banks went on another rant after someone suggested she could have been Nicki Minaj and Megan Thee Stallion's peer. One fan wrote, Kinda weird that Azalea Banks could have been a contemporary of Nicki Minaj and Megan Thee Stallion if she was not unhinged. And so this triggered Azalea Banks apparently and she went on to say some choice words about both of the rap stars. So Azalea Banks starts with Nicki Minaj by saying she is fat and has a Percocet addiction. She then goes on to say, Barb keep forgetting that Nicki is blacklisted for mocking the Vatican on live broadcast TV. Ken Elrich counseled her a long time ago. Azalea Banks has a messed up sense of humor but no history of opioid abuse and no history of caping for snitches and pedos. She then goes on to say, I would never be Megan Thee Stallion because I would never lie about getting shot in the foot to gain public sympathy and capitalize on the protect black woman narrative conveniently when Breonna Taylor untimely demises national news just to then release a horrible album. And she did not stop there. She went on to say that Nicki Minaj is basically canceled, that she went from being an international pop star to a ghetto rap girl, and that she's basically piggybacking off the success of Doja Cat and Megan Thee Stallion. And she finishes by saying, I didn't perform at SNL with bullet holes through broken glass on the lead screen invoking very graphic imagery of a black woman's the mass to capitalize on it when my drunk night out at Kylie Jenner's house gone wrong is not even comparable to the tragedy of a black woman literally being shot by the police. Azalea Banks is the least problematic. So she made some valid points, but her being the least problematic is an absolute reach. Azalea Banks gives very much unhinged, and just a peek into her history would support this. Do y'all remember when she was sacrificing chickens? But to her, everything she has done makes her redeemable. And again, this isn't her first time coming for either one of them. But do you think Azalea Banks makes some valid points or is just just another rant?